אז בוקר טוב, אני סארה, אני קורדינטור של איקו ישראל גאפ יר פרוגרם, את חווה ואדם. אנחנו חווה ואדם גאפ יר פרוגרם. אנחנו חווה שתי קוהורטים בתחילת השנה, אחת היא מספטמבר עד פברואר, ואחת היא ממרץ עד אוגוסט, וזה מ-18 עד 22. During our five-month program, it's a five-month gap year program where um, we study and we work. Um, within the program, we get a, it's a permaculture design course um, on a sustainable farm. The work that you guys do is sustainable work, and through the work you also learn, um, whether it's work in the organic fields or throughout the farm. And at the end of the program, you'll re receive a permaculture design certificate. Um, which will allow you to work professionally on other eco farms. Huh? One second. I don't know. Okay, throughout the course, not only will we learn only permaculture, we also learn other aspects of permaculture, including natural pharmacy, mud building, and weaving from natural materials. Um, throughout the program, For example, for mud building, not only will we learn to build with mud, we also have a project at the end where we build either a mud oven or something in the Ecoville, which is where our participants stay, something around the farm, or just a project that uh, the participants want to do. In natural pharmacy, we learned how to make shampoos and, and soaps and natural remedies that we can use um, daily. And weaving from natural materials, we learn how to weave baskets and learn about... Um, ancient uh, arts. So the Chavav Adam Farm, we are located in Modi'in, um, which is about a 40-minute uh, bus or train ride either to Tel Aviv or to Jerusalem. Um, and Chavav Adam is an eco-educational center and organic farm. Um, we're a holistic center that focuses on growth and self-enhancement through interactions between human and their natural environment. On the farm at all times, we have uh, eco-Israel participants, as well as Shinshinim, which are Israelis um, doing their Shnat Shavut, so that are also doing uh, volunteer year before their military service. And we have armies doing their national service on the farm, as well as um, coordinators and other workers on the farm that come every day. So the, our participants um, have a close relationship with the Shinshinim and the Shulomi, which also gives them um, a taste of Israeli culture. Um, and I forgot to say, every cohort is usually between 15, uh, 10 to 15 participants. Our program encourages practical work and pro proactivism in order to learn about and fully experience these special elements of sustainable living. It is through hands-on learning that we begin to meet ourselves in our work and where we are able to start a personal journey of understanding and growth. Um, so throughout the, the program, not only do we study, but we also, you can see in the picture on the left, we work, um, very much work the land um, and learn how to grow our own vegetables and to eat our own food that we grow and very much connect to nature. Um, also in our Ecoville, All the, the um, living situations, yurts, um, the kitchen, everything is fully sustainable. We have solar power. Um, the kitchen is with biogas. Um, the uh, bathrooms are compost toilets. So you very much get to connect to nature through the whole experience. Uh, a normal day or a normal week on our program is, um, this is uh, an example of Uh, week that we had a few weeks ago. So for example, on Sunday, you get to the farm. Every weekend is an open weekend besides the first weekend of the program and the last. And then usually there's weekends throughout the program that the participants will decide together that they want to stay. Um, so on Sunday, you will come to the train station. We will pick you up and then um, mud building with Edith. Um, after that, you'll clean up your eco villa and your yurts. You'll have an opening and group activity with either me or somebody else in the farm and then dinner. On Monday, you will have herbalism with Valeria and work um, after lunch. Um, Tuesday, you'll have agriculture with Rena for the whole day. Rena is um, in charge of our organic farms, uh, organic uh, areas. So you'll learn how to, with her, how to grow organic um, vegetables. 
Um, on Wednesday, seating and greenhouse with Ben, permaculture with Rena and work. On Thursday, work and um, closing with Oma. The work and the, the studies very much depends throughout the week. Um, we have, perm like I said, permaculture course, mud building, herbalism, and, and weaving, as well as sessions with other coordinators uh, on, the, on the farm about Judaism and Hebrew lessons and other things. Um, we also have a lesson about beekeeping and about compost and about compost worms. Um, so it very much depends between week to week, but usually there's about two full days of work and um, the rest is either studying or lessons with somebody else activities with somebody else. Throughout the program, there are a few trips. Um, we have a week trip to the north, um, which very much depends from uh, cohort to cohort. Cohort. This past, a few weeks ago, we were in the north and um, we went to the Kineret. We went and we did water activities and trips because it was hot. In the winter, um, I know that, the, that we went to the Geomon, we saw um, snow and Tzfat. Um, we also go to a week in the south to either Notz, Madara, or Lotan. We see ecological kibbutzim. And we very much see different um, ways of life within Israel. We go to Jerusalem. We see the sites around Jerusalem. And we also go to day trips around Israel, whether it's to um, a food force in Kidron, um, other eco villages around us. We go to day trips in Tel Aviv. Um, and yes. This is a picture of our last two groups. And if you want to join us, email us at ecoil.chavadam.org. Our next, next sessions are from September 4th to February and March through August. Um, applications are still open uh, for the September program. It is closing soon for March. It's going to be open until about February. And if you guys have any questions, I'd love to answer them now. Thank you. If anyone has any questions, make sure to type them in the Q&A and I'll be able to ask. If there's no questions, make sure to follow us on Facebook and Instagram at EcoIsrael. Um, at at Havaba Dam. And we would love to see you there, whether it's on Eco Israel or just visiting us when you're in Israel. Um, it's a very special farm and we would love to meet you. Thank you so much. If we get any questions coming through, I'll make sure to email them to you or send them your contact data details. Thank you. Thank you.